The North Texas GLBT Chamber of Commerce offers informational and educational meetings, networking, and advertising opportunities and special events to promote business relationships and support economic and cultural development with the GLBT community. Visit us online today at NorthTexasGLBTChamber.org. Hi, I'm Lisa Rainey. Welcome to DVTV. Today I'd like to introduce our new DVTV anchorman, Ben Briscoe. Thanks, Lisa. Good afternoon, everyone. I'm Ben Briscoe. Here's a look at this week's headlines. Ronald Dominique, a suspected serial killer in the rapes and murders of 23 men in South Louisiana over an eight-year period, pleaded not guilty this week. Dominique, who is in poor health, was transported in a wheelchair by guards to Huma, Louisiana courtroom. He could face the death penalty if convicted. Groundwork Dallas, an 18-month-old environmental protection group, has constructed nature trails in the Great Trinity Forest and enhanced the three entrances to the trails. Coordinators of the group say most Dallas residents are unaware of the 6,200-acre preserve and its attractions, and they would like to promote it as an ecotourism site. Proceeds from the 2006 Lone Star Ride fighting AIDS fell by 39% in comparison to the previous year. The fundraiser distributed $170,929 to its three beneficiaries, which was $109,961 less than the 2005 events. Many say it's because of the reso resignation of its, of its founder, Janie Bush. A federal immigration judge this week ordered the former boyfriend of Constable Mike Dupree to be deported to Honduras. The illegal immigrant Angel Martinez reportedly was arrested and detained for deportation at the request of Dupree. A North Dallas developer hopes to construct a multi-floor apartment building with ground floor retail space at the site of the old Tom Thumb store on Cedar Springs Road. The Oak Lawn Committee is hoping the developer's plan will be supported and it will go soon before the Dallas Plan Commission. Check out Rambo, a gorgeous six-year-old Maine Coon mix. This handsome guy weighs 15 pounds, but he is incredibly calm and laid back. He was abandoned at an apartment complex and is looking for a good home. He's good with other cats. For information, call 972-418-PAWS or visit www.operationkindness.org. And now a check of this week's entertainment news with Gus Klein. Hey everyone, this is Gus Klein with your entertainment news for the weekend. Let's see, this weekend take yourself next door to the Fort Worth Stock Show and Rodeo at 3401 West Lancaster. It's on through February 4th and tickets are 4 to $8. Visit fwstockshowrodeo.com. Saturday is a great night to head to Gay Bingo at the Lakewood Theater. Uh, this month's theme is Grease. Go as your favorite beauty school dropout, T-Bird, or Pink Lady. Tickets are $15. Doors open at 5. And on Sunday, how about a nice stroll in Dallas's only forest? Have a visit of the Great Trinity Forest at I-45 and I-20. Visit groundworkdallas.org for a map and trails. If you have any entertainment news you would like to submit, please drop us a line at dvtv at dallasvoice.com. To find things happening in your neighborhood, please pick up a copy of the Dallas Voice. I am Gus Klein. Have yourself a great weekend. Join us again for more news and entertainment at DallasVoice.com. You can also catch us always on demand at Oakland.tv. From Dallas, Texas, I'm Lisa Rainey. Have a great weekend.